It was once the biggest franchisee for both Pizza Hut and Wendy's, but when NPC International filed for bankruptcy back in July, we knew it was only a matter of time before some Pizza Hut stores would be shutting their doors. We didn't know how many, until now. This morning's biz buzz, another closure during the COVID-19 pandemic, it's Pizza Hut. According to CNBC, NPC International now says it will permanently close as many as 300 Pizza Hut locations around the country and try to sell another 927 as part of a deal with Pizza Hut's owner, Yum Brands. Together, NPC's Pizza Hut inventory of 1,227 stores made up almost 20% of the brand's presence across the country. The pizza chain said in a statement issued August 17, 2020, we have continued to work with NPC and its lenders to optimize NPC's Pizza Hut restaurant footprint and strengthen the portfolio for the future. And today's joint agreement to close up 300 NPC Pizza Hut restaurants is an important step toward a healthier business. NPC has not said which locations might be affected by the closure or even when these might take place, but the franchise has also indicated that a quote, substantial majority of the locations earmarked for closure have dining rooms and are ill-equipped to handle takeout and delivery, and are thus significantly underperforming. CNBC also says the franchisee would relocate employees from closed branches whenever possible. What NPC has not clarified is what will happen to the almost 400 Wendy's franchises that it also owns. CNN reports that shutdowns related to the pandemic in combination with an almost $1 billion debt and rising operation costs are responsible for NPC's bankruptcy. Pizza Hut isn't the only chain that is struggling as a result of the pandemic. In June, CEC Entertainment, the owners of Chuck E. Cheese and Peter Piper Pizza, filed for bankruptcy protection and were working to get a deal that would allow them to save as many of its locations as it could. Business Insider reports that more than 1,800 chain restaurant locations around the country are set to close. The affected companies include TGI Fridays, which could permanently close 20% of its restaurants, the parent company of Sweet Tomatoes and Soup Plantation, which has closed all of its restaurants, Ruby Tuesdays, which has lost 147 restaurants since January, IHOP, which will close 49 restaurants in Virginia, North and South Carolina, as well as Tennessee, Starbucks, which will lose 400 company-owned stores, Dunkin', which will end its partnership with Speedway gas stations and close all of their 450 stores, and McDonald's, which will close about 200 restaurants, about half of them inside Walmart stores. Check out one of our newest videos right here. Plus, even more mashed videos about your favorite restaurant chains are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.